We just got done building some big, beautiful new rack systems for the fish cave. So what do we need? More tanks. And luckily I was able to hit up Pet Supplies Plus for their dollar per gallon sale. I actually recorded this a couple months ago. So right now, if you're watching this in November, actually Petco has a dollar per gallon sale right now, but definitely um, look around to other big box stores, whether it be Petco, PetSmart, um, or even Pet Supplies Plus if there's one near you to see if they do some matching because dollar per gallon sale, you can't beat it. Anything up to 40 breeders, not including 40 breeders, are dollar per gallon. And then 40 breeders, 55, 75, are all half off. We've got a few potentially surprising firsts today. This is actually our second stop, but I just started filming. We're at Pet Supplies Plus, my first time ever here today. And uh, we, this is our second stop because we're on a hunt for tanks. This time, new tanks. Believe it or not, this is the first time I've ever really took advantage of the dollar per gallon sale. Right now at Pet Supplies Plus, which Pets Plus, I don't know if they're everywhere in the country or out of the country, Canada, other places in the world, but there's a few here in Central Florida. And um, the first stop only had second or seven. I need to get 12, 20 longs today. Now they're online, said they only have two here, so that'll work. I think um, we have to go get seven, two, two, and one in order to get our 12, if their online stocking is correct, and the first one was. But let's check it out. It's a pretty clean store, the first one. Very, very helpful. Big shout out to, oh gosh, Robin and Felicia. Super helpful ladies at Pet Supplies Plus. Just got finished with stop number two. Picked up two more 20 gallon longs. We have a total of nine. Starting to rain. Big shout out to Alicia who helped me out here. Customer service at these Pet Supplies Plus are freaking top, 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 top notch. Uh, so we got two little 10 gallons. <laughs> this is taking up more space than I thought. But onward we go. We got room. We can fit another one or two here. Master at Tetris. Let's go. The third stop, and once again, we have met some uh, awesome people, awesome employees at this Pet Supplies Plus. Uh, for the record, we're in Central Florida. I give them a, all a shout out. This has been the Pet Supplies Plus in, what is it, Winter Garden? No, I'm sorry, Winter Park. Then up in Sanford. And then also, uh, right now, we're at the one in Oviedo. So big shout out to all those Pet Supplies Plus and those employees. We're gonna hit up, I think, the Conway one next. We now have 11 of the 20 longs. And we picked up another two uh, 10 gallons. So we got four 10 gallons, 11 20 longs. We could fit one more 20 long here, hopefully. And that's all we need for the 20 longs. May scoop up a few more 10s. Eh, maybe not, we'll see. At this point, it's pretty much official that fish are like my life, right? This is more than a hobby, as this is like a lifestyle, a livelihood. Here I am, car, truck full of tanks. I'm on the side of the road, waiting for all these cars to pass by, so I can open up my door to go see what fish we can find in this pond over here. It's been raining lately. Turn the truck off. It's been raining lately, and for the last few weeks, I've been carrying not just the tanks in the back, that's just for the last few minutes. Carrying our dip nets, shout out to Corey at Aquarium Co-op who hooked us up with these. Um, actually, oh, I do have my little, um, also shout out to Aquarium Co-op. I got my, my aerator and uh, air stone. I don't have my bucket in here anymore, so I don't have a five gallon bucket. Need to start carrying that again. Um, but technically we do have fish tanks to put water in if we do catch something really special. The goal here is just to kind of give a scoop and see what's going on. I'm a crazy guy out here at this, not, I didn't think it was a busy corner, but apparently it's a busy corner. We got some ducks in here, had a lot of rain. It's just like a retention pond, so I'm not expecting to catch anything crazy. I'm not worried about gators really over here because, I mean, you know, if there was a big one, they usually remove it. Always worried about gators, but I just mean like extra worried. There's a lot of clear areas, not a lot of bush, not a lot of hiding things. Obviously, he could come from the water, but um, not a lot of area to get ambushed. Let's give it a swipe. I'm gonna do like a one-handed swipe. I need to start carrying my GoPro. Pretty cool plants here. Let's see what we get. One-handed swipe. Looks like a lot of beetles and stuff. No fish. This might have just been flooded too soon. I feel like this may have been like, uh, now that I'm thinking about it, this may have just been like dry like two days ago. Here. Oh crap, now my sandal. I'm gonna start carrying my water shoes as well. My sandals just fell off my foot or twisted over onto my foot. So you're rolling ankle, folks. Okay, I refuse to put the camera down. All right, it's back. Yeah, I don't think there's much anything here, but I'll stop again if we find another spot that actually has some stuff. 
because that'd be cool. We have arrived at the fourth and final Pet Supplies Plus of the day to pick up the final piece to our puzzle, the 12th tank. Let's see, hopefully we're four for four. We're supposed to have exactly one. Let's see. Should not have hesitated, but that's okay. That was actually, wow, I'm sweating more than I thought. Holy crap, that is embarrassing. Is that my beard sweat? That is weird, oh my God. Anyway, what the heck? How is that possible? Anyway, um, <laughs> shoot, we gotta go to another store. I wonder how many Pet Supplies Plus I've been walking around with a wet freaking, it was raining out earlier for a little bit. Oh gosh, my glasses are crooked. I'm wearing my, my half-assed glasses. But um, we gotta go to <laughs> another Pet Supplies Plus. I called this place first. They're the closest one to my house. They had one left. So I thought that'd be the final puzzle piece. Circled back around, start up north, trickled back down. And um, yeah, they sold it in the last hour or two. So it's okay, we gotta go a little out of our way. Um, but there's a store that has two. So hopefully by the time we get there, they um, they still have one of them. And their system was good. They actually updated when I was in this store and refreshed it. Yeah, it's probably sweat, that's disgusting. Um, I go through at least two or three shirts a day. I'm wearing the Loach Gang shirt today. Um, but especially here in Florida, it's like 90 degrees here. So at least it's not that crazy. It's bad when my fat butt is sweating like this in you know, December when it's 70 degrees here. Now I'm the only one doing it. Um, I digress. Let's get going. Let's finish this up. Get the final puzzle piece of the tanks and then get home. Here we go. Pet Supplies Plus, fifth one out on the east side of town here in Orlando. One more tank. Let's get it fifth and final one big shout out to luna the bird the parrot i forget your owner's name a big shout out to luna this cool parrot got one more 20 long and one more 10 gallon so we're set to go just got to bring the cart back because do not want to get caught by the cart narcs I'm not sure if there's any florida cart narcs out here but uh don't want to get cart narked just got home gonna run these tanks inside we are halfway done with the 20 gallons let's go get the rest accomplished we got Two, four, six, eight. Wait, eight. Oh, that's right. It's four over here. So we got 12. This is my command station. This is where I edit when I'm actually editing. 12 20 gallon tanks in from the rain. Five 10 gallons. I was going to go with six, but the last store or two I went to didn't have any. Not a big deal. Not going to set those up right away. But these 12 20 gallon tanks got a glass drill bit in the mail. So we're going to drill some tanks again. And these already have spots for all eight and 12 of these guys that will go into the rack system that we have built. And then these will be for a new rack system that is uh, not yet built, but projects, expansions, moving forward. Excited to get this done. Big shout out to Pet Supplies Plus and all the people, all the wonderful, cool, awesome people I ran into today, including Luna the Parrot. I think it's a parrot. Um, Macaw, maybe. Not sure if you can tell, but this is not a navy blue shirt. This shirt was like teal earlier. I am soaking wet, sweating, and rain. It's all good though. Another day's work. And I'm not done yet. A little mini haul at the dollar per gallon sale. Got six 10 gallons here. Picked up this while we were out. Also from an offer up deal. That's a 55 gallon dual iron stand. And then we got a few more 10 gallons and another 20 gallon long in here. So we picked up 11 10 gallons and a 20 gallon long. Back to the fish cave. Now we've got all the tanks we need. And the next step will be to set them up, AKA drill them. We're gonna paint the bottoms. That'll be in an upcoming video. Check out how to drill a tank right here. More awesome fish tank hauls right there. I appreciate you guys watching, especially to the end. As always, stay positive and stay passionate.